And in this segment, we are going to start with the final phone call, I believe, for the chop shop. There's a couple of cars I need to round out my collection. I'm willing to pay top dollar for any car on the list you can find. And there you go. We'll find those eventually. Um, well, by that I mean I'll just do it off screen. None of the cars are particularly difficult to find. But our first order of business will be to capture that stronghold over there. Which if I had timed this well, or if I had done this right, I could have done... I could have uh, had that done, or at least started it, but whatever. So anyway, to recap for anyone new, or people watching this a day later on a playlist or something, last time we lost one of our comrades, Carlos, and we got revenge by killing uh, Marrow's bitch of a girlfriend. So that's some good shit right there. So, anyway, we're going to, of course, take over another strong, one of the Brotherhood's strongholds. And I may not follow the legal route, depending on how much of a pain in the ass it is, because it looks to be quite the pain in the ass. Yeah, that looks like a real pain in the ass. I'm going to try and, uh... Actually, no. Actually, that doesn't look so bad. At least I don't have to get on the freeway, I don't think. When these people get it, and, and no music, because nothing's going on, and I don't... I don't want to put on music just for the sake of putting on music. But it's only because YouTube, you know, the YouTube Content ID bullshit. Like I've said a million times. Also, while I'm here, I could probably find a bag boy. Which I probably should actually uh, look for that. When I'm done. Also, I'm pretty sure I just saved a ton of time by going the, that shortcut. Also, what is that activity? Oh, it's drug trafficking. Yeah, I'm not doing that yet. Now I forget what to I do. I used to here. date this guy, Richie, who works as a baggage handler at Wardle. Well, the other day, I found out he was holding, so I stopped by to say hi and smoke a bowl. Anyway, it turns out that while he was at work, he snuck off to a hangar to celebrate 420 and overheard Marrow talking with some scary Eurotrash dudes. Whatever's happening is involving some serious money, so if you get to the hangar before the deal goes down, I'll bet you can wire that money to us. After that, if you're still feeling psychotic, you could take out the Brotherhood and whoever they're dealing with. So yeah, thanks, Shondi. Uh, okay, I was gonna say that's enough. Oh, I kind of remember this. I have to go in there and do that, and I think it just—I think this one can be hard if I remember correctly, because these guys could randomly have machine mini guns or grenade launchers or something. Unless I'm completely misremembering. Which there is a possibility that I am misremembering this and confusing it with something in Saints Row 3. I know there's something similar in 3. Because I played those, I played that one more recently than this. Like, 100%, I mean. Let's kick some ass! Shit. I did actually destroy the thing. Son of a bitch. That was actually my fault because I shot up their uh, server and destroyed it. We will be doing that on purpose to another group at the end of the game. Which is not too much of a spoiler because yeah, this game is over 10 years old now and uh... Anyone who has any interest in watching this Let's Play has probably already played the game themselves by this point, so... Yeah. Alright, gotta be careful here. There we go. 
All right. <laughs> so we wait. And We're once again, Cobra is one of the most... Cobra with infinite ammo, I should say, is one of the most overpowered weapons. Because look at this. Oh yeah, I was right. They do have rocket launchers. Alright, so... Okay. Okay, there we go. I probably should have replaced the twins with the uh, big swallow, because I'm pretty sure that's more health. I think... I think the swallow's like 60% health, maybe? Uh, nobody needs to correct me if I'm wrong, because I don't care that much. Do I have any? I do have a few rockets in this thing. Let's just use them. Let this go by a little bit quicker. In this game, you can't unlock. Oh, I'm blowing up the planes, too. Okay. Yeah, maybe I should, probably should have uh, saved my uh, rockets for those. If I'd known I was going to blow up the planes, I would have. Fuck, is one escaping? I think it might be. I still can't quite tell if it is. I'm pretty sure it is. Come on. Okay. Whew. I was actually concerned there. Also, oh, this one's trying to escape. I think I may have failed this mission because of that. There we go. Also, I think that's it. Yep. Also, if this were the 10 minute time limit days, this would be literally the only thing I could do. It's ridiculous. Uh, 50,000. Shit, I don't have enough for that. Uh, I was thinking of getting all of the money. I was thinking of getting all the money that I need for all the cribs off screen, but I decided to actually just do the missions. At least kill off the Brotherhood before I do that. It'll just be me repeating missions, and, uh, or activities, should I say, and uh, idling waiting for my cash to build up and then going to each of them hitting the purchase easy. button basically so let's see I'm surprised this car isn't a uh, chop shop target so let's see oh okay let me uh, actually get into a position where I can actually start that mission that race yeah, we're doing racing, since it's here, and if it has anything to do with flying a, flying a damn plane, I am not flying a damn plane. Because I, again, the races don't offer that much. Okay, cool. Three, two, one. Yeah, I'll do this one. Yeah, I like the races when they're fun little, uh, little quick drive events. And if this, if it was like this in Saints Row 1, I would have done the races. But, you know, obviously it wasn't, so. 
Yeah, what the hell can we do? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, careful. Ah. Uh oh, come on. Don't screw me just because I made that little mistake. And. Yep. I think. It might be this one, actually. I'm pr I know one one of these races around here is a plane race. Sometimes I just want to drive this off a bridge. Oh, oh a bitch like you would take me out. Actually, let me uh I'm gonna change my priorities. I said I was gonna look for a bag boy here because these are actually not the easiest things to find. Where is it? Is it this one? No. Was it? Yeah, here it is. See, so yeah, I'm gonna actually search for these a little bit, or at least have them on my radar as I drive to the next uh, destination. And obviously, if I find one, I'm gonna cancel the active I'm going to cancel what I'm doing to deliver it I'm I'm 90% positive this is a flying one Yeah no 3 no 2 no 1 no, I am absolutely not doing that. Oh, ooh, 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 ooh. there's one. Uh, drop, don't die. Holy shit, you see how much damage I suffered there. Shit, come on. Oh, fuck, who's shooting it? Oh, wait. Okay, there we go. Come on, bag boy. Okay, I actually thought it was more difficult than that. Really? To find? Wait, come on. Why is there just random violence here? Now we have to actually chase it. There we go. Let's see, how much of a wanted rating am I gonna get? Oh, none. Good. Oh, so holy fucking... Holy fucking shit, this thing sucks. Not that I'm particularly surprised at this, because this is a, uh... A baggage deliver A baggage truck. For a... F uh, for a fucking airport. I mean... I don't expect it to have great uh, durability. Or er, speed, I mean. Well, it probably doesn't have very good durability either. This is. See, this is exactly why I'm off screening almost all of this. And it's also why I did the same in uh, Saints Row 1. I'll just vote verbally state how to get the trickier ones. Ah, I almost feel bad for that poor bastard. I prefer to not have a one star uh, police notoriety rating. Because far do I have to go? Farther than I would like. So yeah, the amount of progress I'm making in this video is very rapidly declining. So, obviously, as you can tell, I ain't getting shit done. Actually, I think off-screen, once I'm done with this segment, I will actually do all the chop shop missions or the targets 
unless unless I have something to say about a particular target being difficult and how to get it. Because if it would be difficult for me, it would be difficult for some other people as well. Once again, I'm very happy I can just deliver this to any chop shop I want and not the intended one. There we go. So, uh, actually, let's do some trailblazing, because I've not done that yet. Also, I'll have to purchase the the uh, stores in that territory I just bought, which that obviously could be done off screen. Thanks for stopping by. The Brothers of Theta appreciate it. The Brothers of Theta better have cash. Don't worry, we'll scratch one of our pub crawls. That should cover whatever you charge. So what's the problem? Those Jagoffs in Gamma beat our step team. Now they think they hot shit. We need someone to knock them down a peg. You got anything I can use so they know you sent the message? This year we bought a flame suit for pledge hazing. You think you can find a way to work that in? Oh yeah. So this is... I forget if this makes a comeback in later games. I think it does. Three, two, two one, one, go. And yeah, like you, like you see there, you actually want to hit stuff, but you want to hit pedestrians and stuff to give you more yourself more time once you clear the checkpoints. And crossing these flaming, uh, these flaming, uh, flaming lines will trigger an explosion. Also, touching any car just immediately blows it up. And you have unlimited durability with this car, so don't you worry about that. Uh, anyway, oh, wait, it's not a line. I guess it's just... Yeah, you saw that. And you just drive through the, through the checkpoints like so, and yeah. That was that was actually really good. Can you just rinse and repeat this? It's a little bit dull, but it's fun. It would be more fun if I had music, but uh, I'm in one of my moods where I actually give part of a fuck about not having content music on here. Um, that may change at the end of this segment. I don't know. But regardless. And yeah, over a minute on the last check. Two, one. Go ahead, bro. Okay. Okay, I can barely see what I'm. I can barely see what the hell I'm even doing. I would like. Ah, trees, get out of my way. I'd like to see what I'm doing. And since I'm on the freeway, I'm just gonna bash into every car I see. Because, again, this is how you get extra cash. And your... Your... Your car. Your uh, little flaming buggy of doom. Or whatever you want to call it. Has unlimited durability. Holy shit. 
for all intents and purposes, it is like the Rhino in uh, Grand Theft Auto. I got this thing. I may fail the last level or two, but this should go okay. I can barely see. Okay, there we go. I'm gonna hit him. Ah, fuck. I must have aim. There you go. No. Ugh, this is not a good, uh... This is not a good place, I must say. Oh, come on, really? I need to get moving here before I fail the damn activity. I'm gonna fail because there's all this shit in the way. Please don't fail! Okay, holy shit. I thought I was gonna fail that for sure. To be fair, I probably should have too. Oh, fuck you. Getting in my fucking mm. Okay. Probably a certain way I'm supposed to. Actually, I know there's a certain way I'm meant to go about this. I'm a little bit worried. Unless I get some serious time boosts, so I'm gonna fail this still. You always want to have at least two whole minutes. Well, not two whole minutes. You want to have at least 45 seconds on the clock at all times. Okay. That is... Okay, I'm doing okay so far. Okay, one more. And by the skin of my teeth, I did it. Whew. I actually legit thought I was going to fail that one. Three, two, one. Oh, nice. I have a wanted rating. Again, if you guys wonder why I go between notoriety and wanted, it's because notoriety is, of course, what the game calls it, but wanted rating is the Grand Theft Auto term, which obviously this game is clearly based off of. Watch it! Because you want to hit traffic, obviously it's a better idea to go on the wrong side of the road. Hopefully not miss every car like I'm doing. Fucking... Let me see... Also, yeah, I forgot these CDs even... Yeah, yeah. 
I forgot those even were in the game. I remembered them in the first one, but not in this one. To be fair, I don't think anyone collects all of those in the normal playthrough. The only reason I collect the sex toys in uh, Saints Row 3 and 4 is because there's that upgrade where the game itself outright tells you... Outright tells you where they are. If it weren't for that, I absolutely would not bother. I wish... I wish these first two games had that for, uh, gang tags and the CDs. Also, you would think water would destroy this thing, but no, it doesn't. And it does if you get into a large body, like a lake or something, of course, but... Little streams like that don't stop you. And we're done with that. That's level four completed. Three. I could off screen two, after the one. first one of these activities, honestly, but no. And I'd prefer not to do any editing if I can help it. Okay, come on, come on. There we go. go slow because again I can't always see This one is I do like that this fucking 4x4 four four on fo flaming 4x4 four four can just absolutely destroy cars. Like it ain't. <laughs> like it's nothing. Ah, I 
That car might be Get the hell. There we go. Just looking at my timer, even though I have unlimited time, in theory. I say in theory, if I wanted to upload, let's say, a five-hour segment, I could theoretically do that. Not that I'm going to. Oh, shit. That was not good. I fucking failed it! You are a fucking piece of shit, game. Why did I get fucked? If I fail again, I'm gonna cut here. But if I do it on this attempt, I'm leaving it in. Three, two, one. I really don't want to have to edit. Just... 
please make this fucking checkpoint? Whoa, that was a nice explosion. Alright. Please make the last four. Or, wait, yeah, I guess four. 34, 35, 36, and 37. I'm including the one I'm on. So, don't correct me. Oh god, no. No, 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 no. Don't, don't. Don't. One more left. Oh wait, no, I fucked up. I did only have a few more left. Okay. And one more and I might act I'll probably end the segment. Three, two, one. I am not a fan of this fucking environment. I can... On the road. You get out of my road. I can barely see. Okay, there we go. Oh. I'm not trying to get near misses. I'm trying to collide. Goodness gracious. I can't believe I'm missing this easy shit. Give me some chains, you bastard. Get over there. There. Oh, nice. There we go. Ooh. Oh, now I'm just rolling. Oh, yeah. Looks like I'm not going to have much trouble with this one.
Before I end... Okay, I think I am gonna end this segment, because I'm already at, like, 40 minutes. But before I do, I will... Okay, I couldn't even see what I was doing. Oh. Fuck that, I'm driving around. Anywho, I'll just, uh, make comments on each of the, um, uh, Chop Shop vehicles worthy of comments. And again, I'll show off ones that are actually hard to find if I have trouble finding them. Because you do not have to actually go to Foreign Tower to buy shit anymore. At least as far as I know. So. Come on. Alright, so that's that activity done. And I will also purchase a couple of, uh, cribs and purchase those stores in that territory I got. So anyway, activities. Hitman I'll show off. Let's see. Uh, nothing really here. I already got all that. Got, okay. Uh, nothing here. I don't think. Titans might be able to be found if you get a wanted rating, but I don't think that's true, actually. I'm not sure. Uh... I may show this off if it's impossible. Um, this thing, I think you have to uh, get a three-star wanted rating before you see that. Um, okay, and that's the only one I can really think of offhand. So yeah, I will be doing that off screen. Unless one of them's really actually hard to find. And on that note, I will see you guys next time. Good night.